Are you in the club? Hey guys, welcome back. On today's episode, we are going to be using this kit to make some teeny tiny erasers. And these are the supplies that we'll need. The instruction booklet, the molds, and the sculpting clay. We're going to start by making the burger. This is the guide that I use to cut off the right amount of clay. We're going to use the brown clay for the burger. And the first thing that we need to do is roll it into a little ball. Hmm, <laughs> this is hard. The texture of the sculpting clay is very, very different from Play-Doh. It's really hard and I had to crumble it all up into a bunch of little pieces and then roll it back together. And now I'm gonna do that with the remaining white, yellow, and brown, and that will be the putty that we use to make the bun. After you get the clay or the putty all mixed together, it's ready to go into the mold. The directions say to either lightly mist or wipe down the mold with water to help it so that the putty doesn't stick. <laughs> okay, here is our little hamburger eraser. The next step is that we put it in the oven and at a very low temperature for just a few minutes. And I'm thinking that when we do, the clay will warm up and maybe some of these little wrinkles will smooth out. But actually, I was thinking that maybe we would add like a piece of green for lettuce and a piece of red for a tomato. So let's do that first. <laughs> it's kind of boring like that. To make the tomato, I'm just going to cut off a little piece of red I don't know if the clay is always this hard or <laughs> if mine is just really hard, but this is definitely not that easy. I was able to mix together the blue and the yellow to make green for the lettuce. The red was really, really hard and crumbly, so that's about the best I could do. And now we can put this on our hamburger and we will bake this now and see how it turns out. Okay, it has been baked and it has cooled and now we can see if it works. So that part didn't stay together, but that did. So that's good. I'm afraid that the clay that came with this kit is so dry and old that it's not going to work at all. So I'm gonna write on this piece of paper and we will try to erase it and see if it works. Here we go, the moment of truth. <laughs> well, it definitely works, so that's good. I was worried that this was just gonna crumble apart, <laughs> but here's what I would like to do. Oh, it is kind of, it's kind of breaking apart, let's see. I would like to show you the rest of the molds using Play-Doh so you can see what they look like. And I would like to go to the craft store and buy some new fresh clay that is made for this purpose, for making erasers, and then make a second video where we use fresh clay. Because I think the eraser molds are really cute and I think it's fun, but this clay is just, it, is, it must be really old. It's very, very dry and crumbly and really hard to work with. Okay, so it did work, <laughs> so that's good. Okay, so let's give the ice cream cone a try. And we're gonna try this with Play-Doh, so it's definitely going to be different because the texture of the clay is different. This is the cone and this is the scoop. So let's take some brown. We'll press that into the mold. And let's do strawberry. <laughs> let's see if we can add another scoop of ice cream on top of that. Aw, that 
is so cute. Should we try one more scoop? Aww. Next, let's try the slice of pizza. We'll press in our cheese and then our sauce and then our crust. <laughs> Ta-da! Okay, so let's make some little pieces of pepperoni to go on top. There's a closer look. <laughs> That's pretty cute, isn't it? Next, we'll try the waffle. It looks good, but our waffle needs something. How about a little bit of whipped cream? That looks yummy. Who likes hot dogs? There is a teeny tiny little hot dog. We just need to add a little bit of mustard. Okay, let's do one more. Can you guys tell what it is? A little cupcake. Okay guys, that's it for this video. I hope that you enjoyed it. If you did, you can click on the thumbs up button to let me know. Make sure that you leave me a comment and tell me your favorite thing that I made today. I think mine was either the hot dog or the ice cream cone. And don't forget to check back because I'll be doing this video again with some fresh new eraser clay. This is Amy Jo with DCTC. Thanks for watching. Another video, that's the end. Come back soon or we'll miss you, friend. DC, DC. We do toy reviews. DC, DC. And we play with Play-Doh, too. Skits, pranks, eggs and toys. We make videos for girls and boys. Uh-huh, uh-huh, that's right. <laughs>